Welcome back guys to something a little bit different today. We've got a whole box of these awesome looking Hot Wheels Monster Maker monster trucks. Now these do look pretty awesome, so let's waste no time and get straight into things. So yes, yeah, so when I say whole box, there's actually only four in this box, but still, that's, you know, nonetheless, this is pretty cool. Now, I've never actually seen these before. I think um, they used to make these. I think there are some slightly older variations of this item, which I have seen when doing a search. But it looks like you get two Hot Wheels cars and then a monster truck base, which the cars can click into with the wheel holders there. So, but yeah, that's basically it. Um, we'll have a look at the back of this. As you can see, two cars and you get your base. So, and I think that is, I, I don't know if this is the whole set here, but these are all the cars that we have in this set to take a look at today. So let's quickly get this box out of the way and we'll get them all out. But as you can see, there's only three because the fourth one is actually a duplicate, which is a bit annoying considering this was a whole case. But that's why I wonder, maybe these are the only three. There's only three on the back here and we get a stock of four. So we'll put one of these aside. But let's not waste some time. Let's open one of these up, shall we? So we get the monster truck base. Oh wow, it's a proper, I was gonna say it feels a bit cheap, but I don't, I haven't bought a Hot Wheels monster truck in years. I remember the old ones used to be almost all metal. This is like, got quite a bit of plastic, but I don't know, Hot Wheels have cheaped out over the years. So I wonder if their monster trucks now are a bit more plasticky. But yeah, I don't know. It has got movement in the wheels, so when you, drive along you can steer and stuff that is awesome and then oh we get the two cars which i yeah yeah yeah, yeah. there we go what have we got then we got the the shark car i don't know what they call that one the shark cruiser in red with a sort of lava style tampo on there yellow base and we also get this dragon looking car and this is the dragon blaster cool i do like it under the light the wings look cool so yep yeah, two fantasy cars i'm pretty sure all of these are actually fantasy cars in here so no licensed stuff going on here i think the whole idea is pretty simple you got your truck base and obviously these things clip on the wheels so you can just clip the car It, it's not actually as easy as I thought it'd be. You can just clip the car. Oh! Oh, they slide out. Huh. That's quite neat. And they actually pull out slightly. Huh. So we can just put that in there and, oh. Um. Oh, actually. Hang on. They slide forwards. Ah, I was about to say you'd think Hot Wheels would have chosen a car that fits, but no. I think they've actually been a bit more clever than I thought. You can shift these along. Let's get let's get a closer look at this. You can shift them along these points and open them outwards to fit other cars. Well done, Hot Wheels. Actually, not a bad design there. And there you go. So there's the car. Now it's a monster truck. <laughs> I don't know about this one. Mm. It looks all right. It looks all right. I am more interested to see what this car up here looks like, to be honest. So let's let's let, do you know what? Let's just open up the next two. Let's waste no time. I'm I'm in the mood for some opening. So we got base number one, got like a chrome metallic blue outline on the wheels, white wheels and the blue and orange base, pretty neat. And then number two, we've got the one with the grey and green colour scheme. In fact I think I did switch these around the wrong way because we do get the sort of colour schemed cars to sort of match. As we can tell this is red and yellow to match those cars there. So let's start with the cars. First off, we've got a Muscle Tone. Unless they've decided to change the name for this. I'm very sure it's a Muscle Tone. 
There's the base of the car. Yep, muscle turn. Nice Hot Wheels design on the side, number 68. Yellow with the green colours. It is a plastic bodied car with a metal base. Number two. What is this? The I can't remember what this is called now. The Power Rage. Pretty nice. Number 75 in blue. Got you some lightning bolts up the side there. As it's the Power Rage. Yeah, pretty cool. Again, metal body, plastic base car. Or plastic body, should I say. I completely messed it up. Metal base, plastic body. Next up, power pistons, I think. Power pistons, yep. Same again, though. Metal base, plastic body. I Looks like all of these cars are going to be like that. It's a bit strange. But yeah, pretty cool. We've got her. Yeah, what is that logo? <laughs> We've got her and eels. And eels. Her and eels. Part of the Hot Wheels flame from the logo. Some interesting striping on the sides as well. Orange with the blue, and then obviously you've got the lens lights on this one, which is pretty cool. Which is actually part of the base. And lastly, we have the Boulevard Bruiser. Again, nice Samac metal base. Plastic body, but this is pretty cool. Number 75. Blue and orange decals on the white body looks really nice. That is really, really cool. Lensed front, or... Oh no, we've got front lights, which are part of the metal base. And obviously all the grille as well, which looks really, really cool. Yeah, that's actually a really nice fancy casting, that one. And there's the back there. That is probably the, by far the coolest car in this set, in my opinion, obviously. And I... I do really like the muscle tone. It's one of my favourite castings. I suppose the only different car here then is this. Because this has a die cast body instead of a base. But there we are. So we've had a look at all the cars and I think we all know, yeah, they're going to go on the monster truck. That's cool and all. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Make your own monster trucks. I don't know. But... What if we had a truck, monster truck? Yeah, now that's something everyone's been thinking about. Except no one has been. It will, it will go, I will make it. Yeah, it's a truck truck, monster truck truck. Yeah, you know, that works pretty well. I mean, it's a pretty good test, to be fair to it. It holds the cars really well, actually. Oh. Until you do that. <laughs> oh, never mind. But yeah, pretty good test of um, what we can fit in these cars. If we can fit a big truck like this and we can fit most of the Hot Wheels cars, it's just refusing point blank now. That's what I say to that. How about a Porsche? I'm making a mess here. Let's fit the Porsche in. Oh yeah, now we've got a Porsche monster truck. How cool is that? But yeah, I think you get the point with these clip-on features you can basically turn any hot wheels near enough any hot wheels you've got into a monster truck which is pretty awesome my desk is clearly not level <laughs> well yeah that's kind of it really these are there's not much more to say you can build your own monster trucks you can put almost any Hot Wheels car you want on them and you get two cars in every pack, which is pretty cool. So yeah, these aren't too bad, they're actually pretty nifty things. I do quite like it when you can actually put other items on any Hot Wheels car you've got. So you get the chance to modify any vehicle you want, not just having select few. So these are actually pretty cool. I hope you've enjoyed watching. Thank you for sticking around if you've got this far through. Please be sure to drop a like if you've enjoyed and subscribe if you want to. I hope to see you all in the next video and I shall see you... Later.